I actually just lost one of my soldiers, you know, one of my finest soldiers who uh, served under me in Iraq. Um, he was one of the greatest, and uh, uh, he just just became one of the most recent casualties to post-traumatic stress disorder and taking his own life. And you know, this is the real deal. My name is Chad Jukes. Um, I live in Ridgeway, Colorado. Additionally, I'm a disabled veteran after losing my leg while serving in Iraq to an IED attack. After that, I really, I really wanted to get back into the outdoors and return to a, the physical lifestyle that I had enjoyed beforehand. I ended up climbing Lobache with no barriers in 2010. Since then, I've continued climbing, helping others with physical disabilities, whether veterans or civilians, get outside. Now, I have a very amazing opportunity through No Barriers to go and climb Mount Everest next spring in 2016. Um, I'm going to be one of four soldiers yeah, I'm so very excited to represent No Barriers on this expedition and to attempt to become the first U.S. disabled veteran to summit Mount Everest. For me, this expedition is about showing what we're capable of. Also, our team on this expedition will be going out to, with the goal of raising awareness for uh, post-traumatic stress disorder and that is a you know that's a huge huge issue oh my goodness standing on top of Mount Everest and holding the no barriers flag I am really hoping it will be an amazing experience it will just feel so great we need to raise a lot of money to make this thing happen uh, so you know open up your wallets you know, help support us in this effort. Money that is raised beyond what I need to go and climb Mount Everest is going to be used to, uh, to help raise awareness for um, post-traumatic stress disorder and for soldier mental health. And uh, it's gonna help support soldiers in being able to participate in programs like those that No Barriers offers.